Ever wondered what's hiding in the ice? Have you ever thought about what might be trapped in the frozen layers? Imagine ancient creatures and strange things frozen in time. What if ice holds secrets that can teach us about the past? Get ready for an icy adventure as we explore surprising discoveries hidden in the frozen world. It's like opening a frozen treasure chest full of mysterious things that make us rethink what we know. Get ready for a frosty exploration that will make you wonder what else is waiting to be discovered in the icy cold. Ootsie the Iceman Meet Ootsie the Iceman, a remarkable 5,300-year-old mummy that caused a worldwide sensation in 1991 when discovered in the Italian Alps. Named Uzi after the Uzzo Valley where he was found, this naturally mummified man has captured both public fascination and expert attention over the past few decades. Unearthed by two German hikers at an elevation of 10,530 feet in the tessin Jok Pass, this discovery site straddled the border of Austria and Italy. Uzi's remains, clothing, and belongings have been extensively studied making his find one of the most significant archaeological discoveries of the 20th century. The hikers initially spotted the upper part of a human body protruding from the ice, prompting a challenging rescue effort that took several days due to adverse weather conditions. Once freed from the ice, Utsi was transported off the mountain via helicopter to the Institute of Forensic Medicine at Innsbruck Medical University in Austria. Archaeological Conrad Spindler examined the remains and revealed that Utsi, not a contemporary mountaineer, dated back at least 4,000 years old. The icy environment played a crucial role in Utsi's preservation, naturally mummifying his body without the need for human intervention or chemical treatments. This extraordinary find sheds light on ancient human history and the fascinating process of natural mummification occurring not only in cold environments like glaciers, but also in arid places or areas devoid of oxygen, such as bogs and swamps. Frozen Bear and Cub In Russia, scientists found something amazing, a 39,000-year-old frozen cave bear and its cubs stuck in ice. Usually, they only find bones of cave bears, but this time, the ice kept the bear and cub soft part safe. Scientists are excited because they might get DNA from this animal that doesn't exist anymore. The cave bear used to live in Eurasia long ago, from about 300,000 to 15,000 years ago. This new discovery is a big surprise because the bear and cub are so well preserved, including all their insides. Normally, people only find bones. Some wonder if this thing could bring the cave bear back to life, but we don't know for sure yet. This discovery is a big deal, not just for scientists, but for everyone. It makes people think about bringing back animals that disappeared. Sacrificed Incan Children Back in 1999, three mummies were uncovered on the frosty peak of Lulailaco, a stratovolcano nestled in the Atacama Desert. These mummies, famously known as the children of Lulailaco, stand out as possibly the most well-preserved mummies globally. Among them is the body of a teenage girl, alongside two younger children estimated to be about six and seven years old. It's believed that they fell victim to a human sacrifice, a ritual intended to bring about prosperous harvests, and met their end around the year 1500. The children were heavily drugged with alcohol and coca, laid to rest five feet below the ground while in slumber, and left to meet their fate. Their consumption of both skyrocketed during the last weeks of their lives, so it seems that the kids were kept in a state of almost constant inebriation in the time leading up to their deaths. The enduring chill and exceptionally arid air of the region played a crucial role in safeguarding their bodies over the passing centuries. Dinosaur Bones Guess what? Dinosaur bones have been discovered in the freezing Antarctic. This all started in 1986 when two geologists from Argentina, Eduardo Olivero and Roberto Scasso, dug up the remains of an ankylosaur, now named Antarctopelta oliveroi. They found these bones on James Ross Island along with some Trinosaura. More dinosaurs like Glacialosaurus and the huge meat-eater Cryolophosaurus were also found in Antarctica. But here's the cool part, it's not like these dinosaurs were strolling around in a snowy land. Antarctica, as we know it today, only shaped up about 25 million years ago, way after the dinosaurs vanished. Back in the dino days, Antarctica was part of the supercontinent called Gondwana. And get this, it was actually pretty tropical. 
So even though it's icy now, Antarctica used to be a happening spot for dinosaurs when it was part of a big, warm land. The frozen tundra didn't stop scientists from uncovering these ancient bones and revealing a cool chapter in the dino history of Antarctica. Yucca the Mammoth Ice isn't just good at preserving plants and viruses, it's also a champ at keeping animals intact. Scientists are all hyped up about using frozen remains to resurrect extinct creatures, and the woolly mammoth is stealing the spotlight. Mammoths didn't vanish too long ago, just a few thousand years back. Since then, we've discovered several frozen specimens, but the star of the show is Yuka, a baby mammoth found by Siberian hunters in 2010. Originally thought to be 39,000 years old, later tests brought down the age estimate to 28,000 years. But the age wasn't the main attraction, it was Yuka's incredible state of preservation. This little mammoth met its end at the hands of ancient hunters who did some organ and bone removal but left the rest of the carcass untouched, buried for future retrieval that never happened. Thanks to those forgetful hunters, Japanese scientists hit the jackpot. They extracted tissue samples from Yuka's muscles and bone marrow. Even more mind-blowing, they implanted cell nuclei from these samples into egg cells swiped from mice. The result? Some flickers of biological activity, a reawakening of 30,000-year-old mammoth cells. Although the activity was faint, the Japanese team deemed it a significant step towards bringing mammoths back from the dead. Ancient Bacteria Picture this. In 2005, scientists exploring the frozen Arctic permafrost of Alaska stumbled upon something mind-boggling. What did they find? Ancient bacteria, frozen solid in the ice for a whopping 32,000 years. But hold on to your hats, here's the kicker. When these bacteria thawed, they didn't just chill out, they came back to life. According to astrobiologist Richard Hoover, it got even weirder, he claimed they immediately started swimming when the ice melted. This microbial Lazarus moment earned them the nickname Carnobacterium Pleistocenium. Now, these little critters are not your average microbes, they're downright spine chilling. Imagine, after a cool 30,000 years of being frozen, they defied the odds and sprang back into action. NASA was quick to call them the first fully described, validated species ever found alive in ancient ice. It's like a real-life sci-fi tale unfolding in the Arctic. So, if you thought bacteria were just tiny organisms doing their thing, think again. These ancient survivors are rewriting the rules and showing us that life can endure even in the most extreme conditions. Millions of Grasshoppers Hidden in the Beartooth Mountains of Montana lies one of the world's most fascinating glaciers, Grasshopper Glacier. Its name isn't just for show. It's because the ice is packed with millions of grasshoppers. These little critters have been stuck in the glacier for centuries, with some belonging to a species called the Rocky Mountain Locust that vanished over a hundred years ago. The story behind this insect ice haven is pretty cool. Scientists think these grasshoppers were on a journey in big groups when they got caught in heavy snowstorms. Tragically, they perished right on top of the glacier, becoming frozen in time. Now, Grasshopper Glacier isn't your everyday tourist spot. Tucked away in the remote reaches of Custer National Forest, perched 11,000 feet above sea level, it remained a hidden gem until the early 1900s. However, this icy wonder has been facing some challenges. Climate change has caused the glacier to shrink, leading to the thawing and decomposition of many of the frozen grasshoppers. Despite this, Grasshopper Glacier stands as a fascinating testament to a unique natural phenomenon, preserving a snapshot of the past in its icy embrace. And there you have it, Frosty Adventurers. The mysteries hidden within the ice have left us spellbound. Now, before you embark on your next chilling expedition, I want to hear from you. Which icy revelation fascinated you the most? Share your thoughts in the comments below, and let's keep the conversation thawing. If you relish this dive into the frozen enigma, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more thrilling adventures right here on Beyond the Forecast. 
Because, as we've learned today, sometimes the coldest places hold the hottest secrets.